Right, what I'm going to show you today is how to do easy mashed potato with no need to pre-boil your potatoes before you start where you lose nutrients from the potatoes and also you don't even need to peel the potatoes because we're going to cook them in the microwave. Right, now what you can see is I'm going to do two potatoes tonight but um, you just use the amount of potatoes that suit your need. Also you can see I've got a what's called a potato ricer. Now the important thing about this is this is made out of stainless steel which is uh, much much better than other ones you can get. Some of them are plastic so don't waste your time or money on the plastic ones. You must get the stainless steel one. So this is the whole secret to it and you'll see that when we cook the potatoes we cut them in half, put them in the ricer and no need to peel them. Okay so what we'll do, we'll cook the potatoes now and we'll come back and show the process. Okay these potatoes have now been microwaved for a total of eight minutes and after four minutes I flipped them over to the other side so I've got an easy, even cooking right through. Now my microwave is 1000 watt and I cook them on high. Right, now all you need to do is you get your potato and cut it in the halfway point. And the other one. Now we get the ricer. Right, so you put it in, face down, in the ricer. Get your bowl, and then out it comes. Not if you just cut it off there. There's your potato skin. Easy, no peeling. Right, the next one. In again. There's the skin, third one, you can see how quick this is to do. And our last one. And there's the potato all ready to go. Right, now I'll just add, add some milk to it. All you need to do is just use a, a normal common fork and you just mix it up. And you add the amount of milk that you need depending on taste. And you can add some butter as well if you wish. I don't tend to add butter in mine, I find you don't really need it. But if you'd like some butter to taste in yours, by all means just put some in. So you can see, now just mixing it up. And there's our mashed potato, it's done, finished. Unless you want to put a little bit more milk. Get it the consistency that you like. But as you can see, it's now just a matter of putting the amount of milk in that you like. But that's it. Fantastic. No lumps. Perfect. Okay, hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.